Welcome back to Fun with Canva. In tonight's tutorial, we are going to be looking at how to create, I guess, a swell effect with a lady or an image on top and erased at the bottom. So let's get stuck into it. We'll start with a blank canvas. We'll come over to elements. And because I've done this before, we'll just work with some of the elements that I've used. So we're going to choose this one here, woman running outdoors. We're going to click on it bring it into the canvas and we're going to remove the background. Once we've removed the background and we see these three dots here go into a tick, we'll enlarge this out to the perimeters of the canvas for now. And we're going to create a background. We'll put in a background. So we'll come here and we'll use the orange background all right, like that. So what we're going to do now is we're going to duplicate this page and we're going to work on page number two. All right, so that's extended out there. Now what we'll do is we will come over to elements and we will get our swell like so. Then what we'll do is We'll adjust our swell. What we'll do first, I think we'll just bring this in and we'll enlarge this to get a bit better effect for now. Like so. Then what we'll do is we'll adjust our swell. So just keep an eye on what degree you put the swell to. So we'll do it to 20, uh, maybe. And uh, no, we'll do it to. 10 and we'll put it like that just just below the hand or just on the hand like that all right now we want to, what we want to do is convert that to white color and we want to duplicate we want to duplicate to sort of where roughly about there Okay, and then what we want to do is we'll grab this circle, we'll change this circle to white, we'll just increase, zoom in, and we'll position this circle here, we'll rotate it, because now we're going to cover in all the uh, blank spaces, all the orange spaces like so we'll just move that up like that okay and then we'll grab a square as well we'll change that to white so you can do it with one shape or you can do it with a couple of shapes doesn't really matter all right we'll put that there like so Duplicate and run that out there like so. Duplicate and rotate that just to cover there like so. Duplicate again. this here just move this down all right like so and now that you've covered what you want to cover we'll just put one here like so All right, and I just want to cover this last little bit just up here. Like so. All right, then what we do is we just download this 
increase it up there. We'll choose the current page, go download. Oh, one thing I forgot to do. We want to change the page color to white. That's the most important thing as part of this. So change the page color to white because you get your curve. Do the same thing, go download, increase, download, and we'll drop that in here when it's downloaded. I think I didn't select the current page. So remember to select the current page. And when that's downloaded, it will appear up there. Uh, on the Mac, unless anyone can uh, correct me, you can't drag the photo back in, so you have to download it and then upload it. All right, so while well, that's downloading yet, it's a zip. So remember to choose the file page that you want to download. So drag that into there. Then actually you want to come back to the first page. So we'll unzip that. Go into there. And it's that one there. So drag that into page one. All right. And you want to get rid of that one there. Um, drag that down. Position it, middle, center, drag that up there, drag that down there, go background remover, okay, and then if that, if that happens where you haven't um, gone into removing everything, you just come over here, go to erase, and just erase that as such. Okay, just make sure it's all erased. All right, then close that down. Now what you want to do is bring the swell in and we'll increase this. So we twisted it to 10 degrees. So just twist it to 10 degrees and then move that in like that and as you can see that is in place there and covering the bottom so with this you can click on it and you can change it to any color color you like so we can grab the color picker here and we can change it to that color or grab it again change it to that color or grab it again change it to the black color so whichever color you want, you can change it to. So now that we've done that, we'll just drop that down. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. Um, we'll bring this in like that. We'll just highlight both of those. We'll go group and then basically bring that out like that. And there you go. So we've created, we've used a swash and place the lady behind it as if, um, and creating invisibility below. As always, have fun with Canva, and until next time, enjoy, and we'll see you again. Thanks very much. Remember to subscribe to my channel, like, and share, and um, have fun. Thank you very much. Bye for now.